In this lesson, I'm going to share some excellent tips to help you prepare for your first tennis competition. Are you ready? Let's dive into the lesson right now. This video is more for beginning tennis players who has been learning tennis for a while and wanting to compete in tennis. If you have been playing in competitions, you may find these tips useful as well. The first tip that I have for you is to know the rules and scoring of the tennis game. Now, if you are in, the, in your tennis competition and you find yourself unfamiliar with the point system or the rules of the game, you may end up very frustrated when you have to check with your opponent or argue the line course against the opponent. I remember last year when I brought my son to his first ever competition, he was still a bit unsure of the scoring system. So end up, he argued with the opponent on the points, calling the ball out when it's in, etc. So he spent a lot of his energy arguing with the boy. So at the end, I asked him, how do you feel? He said, I feel tired. And the tiredness is not because of playing the game, it's because of the arguing. You have to know the rules and the point system in and out so that you can enjoy the game better and, then, and don't make it become a disadvantage for you. The next tip is to clock some matches before your competition. This is especially important if your training is just rallying with your coach or with your friends and you, don't, you do not clock any match experience prior to your competition. If you don't have any match experience before the competition, then you may not have the feel of the pressure when you're serving with points. All right? You may not know how to cope when you're down or when you are leading in the game. So, this tip is super important. Clock some matches before your competition. The next tip is to try to get used to playing on different conditions. If your match is at 3 p.m., then you may want to try to play on a sunny day, let's say 3 p.m. This is especially when your training is always at night. All right. Now, when you are playing on a, on a sunny day, having to serve when the sun is shining at you is very different from serving at night. So do try to clock some experience in playing on the different condition. Even the surface that you're playing on, if you have access to the competition venue, do try to go there and play for, for one session or two sessions. Get used to the surface, experience whether is it a fast court or a slower court because the surface will affect the bounce of the ball. The next tip is, have a plan. As the saying goes, having a plan is better than no plan at all. Especially now, if you are playing your first competition, then you may want to have one simple plan, such as you want to hit all the shots to the opponent's backhand, or you want to serve all your serve to the opponent's backhand, etc. Now, having a simple plan will help you to stay focused and calm when you are facing with someone that you have never met before. So, do keep this tip in mind have a plan before the competition. Next, set process goals instead of outcome goals. Now, if your objective of going to the competition is to win the match, then there is an outcome goal. And sometimes you cannot control the outcome. However, if you set some process goals for your match, then you may end up enjoying the game even more. Let me explain. Now, if your process goal is such as, for example, I want to make my opponent hit one more shot. Okay, I'm going to put the ball to the opponent so that I can hit one more shot against me. Or I tell myself, in this match, I'm going to serve no more than five double faults. All right. Now, when you set such processes in your match, then it's something that you can control and it's something that you can learn from it. All right. If your goal is simply just to win the match and then there's not much learning point after you play the game. Remember, every match is, an, is a learning opportunity. Learn from the victories and also learn from the losses. And most importantly, enjoy the game. There's always a next match coming. There you have it. Some excellent tips for you to prepare for your first ever tennis competition. If you like this video, do click the like button and subscribe to Unleash Your Tennis channel. That's all from me today. Until next time, happy playing.